So, welcome back to another episode. Um, what I've done, the bird that we've trapped, I've moved him into here. Um, we're going to transport him very soon. He uh, is one that I bred anyway. Leo Storm, little progeny, which are um, looking pretty good. Basically, what we're going to do with him, um, we're going to take him back to his owner because I gave these young birds away to test them. He, he needs to finish the whole race season, this guy. Um, and then once he's done, my friend will probably breed off him because we're going to have so many of these little clones like this running around our loft anyway. We've already got Thunder. We've got another one in the nest now. Um, and then we might even, well, we definitely will do another round from Leon Storm, so we'll produce another one like this for sure. Um, and then maybe after that, we will just look at um, fostering out some eggs from that pair, Leon Storm. Um, under some other pairs because that takes all the hard work off those birds and they can just keep pumping out um, more like this but I need to go out here and check on these breeders um, top up their food while we've got a break in the weather all right let's have a look at you guys Oop, a little bit of pee has made a bit of mess over the last few hours since I saw you out this yesterday we've got a lot of rain at the moment we're getting basically a whole month's worth of rain in four days so we're just gonna have to grin and bear it at the moment which it's not enjoyable because we don't get much rain here generally it's generally sunny and hot all the time but we'll just give these guys a bit of a top up quickly check their little babies um, I'm gonna try and get out here a bit later and give the them a bit of a scrape and just that so we're not getting much time in between the, the showers but look at these little babies this one's a little thunder. Hey, look at you. Thunder Junior. What can you be? Maybe lightning. You can be lightning, maybe. And this one looks like a little storm Junior. Beautiful. Plenty of food in there. And you got plenty of food in there, too. It's funny how this pair just continually pumps out the same babies. It'll pump out one blue bar. It looks like Leo and it'll pump out one little checker that um, pretty much comes out the same as a mum, which which is good. I'm happy with it because these babies are, you know, for me and what I want to do, they're going to be really good. But we'll put them back in there because they're getting a bit restless. Oh, you're falling out, mate. Hop back in. I need to get in here and give this a scrape. This is actually disgusting with this little bit of rain that's come in there. Might even put these seeds in a bit more. We haven't got much rain in there anyway, which is good. We just don't get rain like this. It's just so strange. Ooh, nearly just blew me over. Same thing, they just don't like the wheat, so they seem to tip it all out. Give them the rest of that. And then once you've finished making a mess of this, I'll get, give you a good clean. But another beautiful pair. Alright, come here. Come on. Come on. Look at these little babies. What do we got here? Hmm. I'd say this front one's a blue bar. And then probably that back one looks like a little light checker as well. So we've pretty much got another blue bar and a light checker. Which is no surprise. I was hoping for something a little bit different, but it didn't happen. Anyway, let's go into the main loft, have a look. Alright, we've got a little bit of water in there, that's strange. The, wind, the rain must be coming from a different direction because we generally don't get any rain in here. All these birds are enjoying a little bit of a, the rain, they're all sitting in there. Need to take out those two we had in there from the Leo Storm's little baby, but they're all really enjoying the weather out here. Because I haven't been given the baths the last week, just because the weather's been freezing cold and been a little bit wet. Let's have a look in here and see if we've got anything exciting going on. No, no eggs yet. What are you guys up to? You gonna give me some eggs? Um, so what I'm gonna do with this pair, I'm hoping that she will lay very soon. 
Um, it does look like she's got a bit of a puff up at the back there, so she might be very close to laying. But my plan is I'm going to use these as foster parents. Um, hopefully if they lay in the next two to three days, I've got a pair of eggs that we can put under them. Um, which is going to be good. You guys are going to be very happy if we can pull this off, if we can get these guys to lay um, in the next two to three days. Um, and then when I take Leah and Storm's little baby back, the one that we trapped, we are going to get um, a set of eggs off my friend. Um, and then hopefully they, uh, yeah, I'm just going to ruin the surprise for you. Those two eggs that we're getting are hopefully going to be Tiger Grizzle because they are from the same parents that Oreo was from. Um, just the fact that we didn't get any Tiger Grizzles from the black pair we got from adam so we're going to have to bring in you know some others so we're going to get these eggs we're going to try and foster them we're going to try something different um given everything works these guys lay eggs um very soon the next few days then these two eggs will be ready probably tomorrow um and then we can go get them take leo storm's baby back and put those eggs in here and hopefully these guys will hatch those eggs um they won't know any different but hopefully we'll come out with uh, a tiger grizzle and a spread black like hopefully we'll see what happens so just stay tuned for that hopefully everything works i'm just gonna bit of a spoiler alert for you but um that's what i'm planning with this pair i don't want to breed um a son back to the mother but i'm happy for them to be foster parents because you know that's no problem so when they lay eggs we'll take those eggs out from away um and then we'll slip in these other little eggs they won't know any difference it's gonna be pretty exciting drop some comments down below if you like that idea hit the like button if you want to see that happen if you want to see that video make sure you hit that like button let's get this video cranking because i think that's going to be pretty interesting if we can pull this off never fostered eggs before but um we are within like a couple of days of this so it could work out very well but i would say she's getting close to laying because she's pretty puffed up under here normally she's very lean but she's probably getting close Hopefully today, might have to check up on her later, I would say. But um, yeah, good, exciting times. And I don't think this is anything, is it? Don't think so, that's just a baby. This one, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna have to try, um, still debating whether I pair it up with the other Leo Herman's blue bar hen we have in this loft that we got off Adam, or we just hold this one back um, for a couple of days more. And we might be able to swap this one around with Little Storm. Not sure yet, we'll just see. I'm talking about this one, this one's a baby. Um, he thinks he's in the nest still. But we'll see, that's what I'm thinking. I would much prefer to see this cockbird with Little Storm just because those two together would produce very good babies, much better babies than what the big blue bar she's with now. I feel like um, body size wise and all that kind of thing, I think that she, her, Little Storm and this guy will go bit together much better and produce much better babies. Because, where's the other blue bar? She's here somewhere, there she is up there. This one here is a bit musclier, because um, she's Leo. Oh, that's not her. She's got a yellow ring. Where is she? There she is there. This one, she's out enjoying the rain. So this one here, I think that she's probably better to go with that big cockbird. They are from the same family of Leo Hermans. Except that he's got um, Huben crossed into him. But she's got the angry bird eyes too. So I think they're probably the better pair. But I think it's going to be good. I think it's probably the better pairing. But drop some comments down below. Let me know what you think. Hey, what are you doing? You're a very sweet bird, aren't you? About uh, you. How you been? You alright? No. Everyone else is going pretty good. Anyway, I am going to catch all you later. It's just a little quick update. Um, let me know what you think about the fostering eggs idea. It would be very different, something exciting, something different. Um, and we do get to bring a tiger grizzle back into the loft because there's a very high chance that um, we will get one tiger grizzle out of that. Are you scared of me? You're still getting used to being in this loft. But you'll be a good breeder. We just need to get our pairings right, I think. Catch you later.